Hello and welcome to Boomer Guards Travels. Today we are going to try out the characters, right? So last video I kind of posted an update. Uh, I spent a little time in uh, Plane of Innovation uh, trying to uh, perfect what I what I want to do. And I'm, I might have something here, I don't know yet. Uh, uh, I've changed up a lot of stuff on how they work and they they no longer work the same way so I'll, I'll probably go over it at some point uh but we're gonna kind of go and see how this all goes uh i'm currently driving mostly from the enchanter uh to play she is my uh she just works better <laughs> it just works better doing this i tried doing it from the the wizard and uh I was not have I was not having as much success. So, what are these guys calling? These are yellow. What the hell? All right. So we have uh, two mercenaries, a uh, two wizards, and a healer. And uh, oh, there's the death knights we're looking for. <laughs> so it looks like somebody's here, uh, killing everything. What is this guy calling? This guy's blue. He's 63. All right. So what we're gonna do? is uh i have now have a button uh number two will make the other two guys assist me and then uh what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna send the uh the mage pet with numpad three so he goes in i'm gonna tash this thing uh, i'm gonna set it as x target 19 and i'm gonna charm it with command of druzzle and i'm gonna set uh the pet here the uh mage pet to uh x target uh 20 so we can do that so we're gonna go here i'm gonna press two to ass make everybody assist me send the pet and uh not pacification there we go and we're gonna slow this guy i i don't know how hard this is i was just like absolute destroying <laughs> uh <laughs> plane of innovation uh, so, okay. Now, now that we got everybody right here. So if I hit four, these two here will now assist me on the target they already have from hitting two to assist. I, I do not have, um, I do not have the uh, assist inside the, uh, attacks anymore. I separated assist into its own button. And that is to, uh, uh, that is to mostly prevent it. So like, you know, as an enchanter, I'm going to be switching targets a lot. And if I, if I'm targeting something I want to mez or something like that, I'm going to, I still, I'm still trying to figure out the spells. I don't have, uh, I don't have them down to where I want them yet. And, uh, if I am not targeting the, what I want them to attack, like say I can hit four right now and they're doing that and I can go off and do my own thing target wise and I'm not I don't have to worry about them so and they and they they are set up with multi bind so all their spells are all in the same like multi bind here so I don't have to worry about uh them getting locked so this is one of the problems I was having is I had like pause 20 cast 5 right pause 30 cast 5 I was I had that kind of stuff going on in all their macros and uh, I don't have to deal with deal with that. All right, my mess broke, so I want to hit a six. This is a target X target nineteen and cast command of Druzzle. And uh, let's go ahead and uh, send him in. There we go. Let's re uh, arcane rune. This is our uh, rune spell, and then we can go ahead and nuke this guy down. And it's looking good. Like I, I have the mage pet up here, so he's it's a water pet, so it's obviously not the best. But at the next level, she's gonna get an earth pet. And we're gonna we'll try to stick with earth pets from this point on. As soon as we get it, I was gonna summon an air, but I'm just being too lazy to do that. All right, so there we go. It's working pretty good. And the the mercenary heals the charm pet, which uh shows you how much I knew about that right I didn't think that was a thing that they would do so it's nice all right there's a guy here doing his thing what was he got doing? Oh, you gotta go down here you gotta all right you're doing that I'm not gonna interrupt interfere with your cam buddy let's go over here all right uh 
let's go back this way. Kind of see if we can find any of these Death Knight mobs. I think we were here like a few videos ago trying to do this exact same thing. That's why we have one of them already done. Uh, there's a warrior. Let's go ahead and uh, snatch him. So, Tash, Assist, Pets. And so, I, what I gotta work on is not getting hit. <laughs> that is my goal. Why are you not attacking? There we go. So, I, I gotta, I have to work on that. That's gonna be a thing. I'm thinking, I'm thinking root might be like the way to go. Uh, but I'm still not 100% sure. Let's go ahead and slow this guy. There we go. So there's there's a lot of optimization I think I can make into this setup. Right now they're doing they're doing pretty good. And the two mercenaries, like I don't know when I was I had the two two caster mercenaries with Boomerguard, I felt like they he was an unstoppable force of destruction. Uh, I don't feel that there is a strong now, so uh, maybe they got nerfed or something. Uh, but what is this guy? Level sixty-eight, ready to kill me? All right, we're not gonna, we're not going down that path. All right, what about over here? Uh, another guardsman. Let's go ahead and grab him. Assist, assist. Send the pets. There we go. And then uh, we're gonna put Night Star Terror on. That guy. Perfect. And it looks like a rune. Did no all the runes is there at the top. Do these stack? Like No, they don't. Alright, so <laughs> I thought I'd get lucky there. Alright, we got more loot to uh, figure out. Let's go through here. I just picked this one as a thing. It's a level 65. Daily quest. But I wanted to kind of... You know what I'm doing? I have my... Because there was a box. I have her thing all the way down. That's why I can't see anything. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Assist. That's uh, target. I fight. And there we go. And then each of the other characters. They can nuke if they want. When I push uh, for, I don't have the caster, or the enchanter nuking right now. I have it memorized, but I don't really need to uh, worry about it. Like the charm pet seems to be like just destroying stuff. So that's really like where most of my damage is coming from at the moment. Let's go ahead and uh, attach this guy. Come on. Assist. Send the pets. Uh, at some point, the mage is going to get, like, Spirit of Wolf for her pet called Velocity. And, uh, when we get that, I'll, it'll be a lot easier for the, uh, pet to kind of intercept, if you will. Uh, and I didn't, I didn't summon any stuff for the pet. I didn't know how, how well it would do, but as you can kind of see, it's getting chunked down. I have it on, I have a taunt on, on the mage pet, and then by default, the, uh, charm pet is going to do that too and you can kind of see here like that charm pet is hitting for 500 uh you know 500 ish right now so it is uh definitely a uh a force to be reckoned with <laughs> makes me kind of regret not charming with uh with uh holdridge but i did get a few comments saying that people kind of gave up on charming pretty early uh, because they couldn't find mobs and stuff like that. So, like, if you remember when we we did Kale on one of the one of the series, like there was nothing I could charm. It's like no mobs. So, what's down here? Like, I know there's a pit down here with like a bunch of mobs, but can we can we do it? <laughs> I don't see what I need anyway, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna jump down there. I remember back in the day we used to jump down there, kill in that arena, but all like levitate and uh, other things. Let's just kind of go down here. Maybe we can piggyback past this guy. He might be making camp there on that wall. There we go. 
just is he just sitting here no oh, he's gone all right maybe he got his uh stuff out looks like he's moved down here a little bit further there's a death knight there's two death knights is that what you're going for buddy Let's see I, I don't speak uh elvish so i can't do much there. All right. Is that my pet? <laughs> oh, so six. For some reason I only uh I only did Elvish on my uh on my uh warrior. I didn't do it on any of the other characters for some reason. Alright, let's just go back up here because uh that guy's down there. There's got to be like another path I could take through here, right? All right, so over there by that other guy. At level 68, I don't know. I, don't know. I think we can probably just try to kill him, right? I mean, what's the worst that can happen? We die? The pet dies? I mean... I'm not too concerned, right? All right, buddy. You're gone. <laughs> we'll tash him and mallow him and stuff. All right. Uh, assist. Go forth and conquer. Go forth and conquer. All right. I'm going to tash him. I'm going to slow him. Because he's, he's not winning right now. He's slowed, and yeah, I don't have Helix yet. I'm like used to my uh, the 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 100 uh, Enchanter we got with uh, Holdridge, and uh, I'm trying to remember here. So let's get some nukes on this guy here. He's like almost dead. We're killing him. He's red. He's a deep red too. He's 68, and we are 64. So he's got four levels on us. But he's got nothing on us. <laughs> we got 1.99% experience for killing that guy. All right. Good job. Good job. Oh, whoa. Hey, whoa, whoa. Another named. All right. All right. You know, this is how we go. We just kill. Um, what the fuck? Oh, gosh. Oh, my pet broke. Ah, this is absolute chaos. Uh, six. Let's get this, uh, let's get this charmed. I got stunned, too. Like, I don't have all my, uh... Alright. Rune. I don't have any stuns memorized right now. It's something I didn't really think about. I'm sure the mercenaries are gonna save our butts here. Alright. Assist me kill this thing here. Alright, so what am I what are, what is here? <laughs> Alright, pet broke again. Is there something like dispelling? That could be a thing, couldn't it? Alright, everybody attack that. Where is the I don't know where the mage pet's at. Doing mage pet things, I guess. There he is. It's gonna be a little bit rough the next few episodes, I'll tell you that, until I figure this out. There's Shadow Master. There's that guy. Let's see if we can burn this uh, one guy, this ad down real quick. There we go. Alright, now everybody assist. That kill that thing. Alright, my. Let's go up here, because. I was like, oh my god, really? Again? Is this thing like dispelling? Like, it might. My nuts. Arcane rune. Oh, the mage pet died. Jeez. Uh, oh, and I don't have one memorized. What on earth? All right, thing, the thing died. So <laughs> the pet killed it, I guess. All right, uh, let's get another pet up real quick. 
Uh, what's the highest we got? Let's do the air one, because I don't want fire. I don't know why I didn't have that memorized, so that's... That's an oopsie. Alright, and then we're going to uh, burn out. Uh, I think group buffs hit pets. Not yet. Not yet, she doesn't have the AA yet. Alright. So let's roll this. And all this can roll. Alright, let's keep making our way over I mean... These characters are a little bit overpowered anyway, uh, just because the the mount buffs and stuff they have. So they're not. Oh my god, another one of these stupid guys. What? Where am I? I'm not anywhere I probably should be. This guy is breaking so much. Tash. Command. Dumb me, I should have put him. I should make a mallow macro uh, to have it mallow. I didn't think about that. All right, we're not going up here. This is this is just like dumb territory. It's not doesn't even have anything we want. Oh, we want that mall. I got right over there. Come on, run! All you little gnomes, run! Don't fall in the pit because you're dumb if you do. There we go. Assist. All right. Air pet is on. Air pet is in action. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. The air pet should be a little bit tankier. Uh, if I remember right, anyway. Alright, let's get Elder Drune up. I, I can't wait until we get to the Unity, uh, Unity line of spells, so I don't have to, like, worry about all these self buffs and stuff. There's a lot of a lot of weird buffs that I don't want to deal with right now. All right, we got two of five. Uh, let's see here. Taking down mental notes of things I need to do, right? Like they need uh they need uh the mallow, so I'll need to have to, uh, a macro to mallow the pet, which shouldn't be that hard. Um. I'll have to just set it at X target. This <laughs> is a stupid thing too. Does he not know how to path over to me? Let's do a who. Alright. This is not the way. Let's keep going here. Archmage. That's me. Those are me. Uh... Yeah, the Berserker guy. Alright, he's still there. Hopefully he's only staying for the daily. Absolutely nothing. That's the zone in. Or zone out. Alright, we got an Armsman and a Guardian. Alright. Assist. Send the pets. Let's go ahead and slow this. I feel like slow is probably going to be probably one of the better things I need to be doing. Even though this charm pet doesn't need slow, right? Like he's got probably a million hit points or some nonsense like that. And uh, I probably don't need to, but I think I'm going to because I, I'm taking a lot of hits right now. And until I get a little bit better at this, uh, we're going to be taking a lot of damage. that we could otherwise avoid. All right, send it in. Send the, send the mage bat. That whole having the assist on the separate key is, uh... I said, no! <laughs> Spam it like 30 times. All right, let's get that one slowed. And let's go get some nukey nukes on here. Look at this. How much is, uh... 
Yeah, I don't have uh, show others on. Alright, I don't want the ethereal parchments. I deleted like six of those that I had in my bag. Alright, another warrior. So everybody should be able to make it over there now. Perfect. I will get the, like, uh, I'll, I'll summon the mage pad, uh, the earth one when we get it, right? We'll summon him weapons, we'll summon him uh, a belt and all that nonsense, and he should be good to go. There we go, recharm. You son of a gun. <laughs> is, this, is this how this is going to be? I know later on she gets an aura that lets her charm for longer, but I mean... This is a little ridiculous. It broke instantly. All right, let's get some nukage. Being very cautious. I'm doing a lot of things I'm, that I haven't done in a long time. I always play from a tank uh, because you can just jump in there and don't really have to care about anything else. Uh, there's a lot going on now, so a little bit different. Especially this jack o' lantern breaking every five seconds here. Get in there. All right, go over there. Kill that guy. Thank you. Do your job. All right. What about over here? Ah, another warrior. Assist. Send the pets slow. Yeah, they just move so slow. They don't get it. They don't get the buffs like the group buffs, right? Uh, the uh, I still have I still have buffs from my my other cleric. Uh, but the the mercenary hasn't buffed us yet. All right, let's get some nukes on here. Try not to nuke too much so they don't run out of like mana or anything. Since I I am doing uh, the multi bind. They will definitely run out of mana. Every time I push that button, they're going to cast something. All right. All right. This is working pretty well, I think. Besides the annoyances from the, uh, the, the pet, right? But I guess that's fine. I have the mage pet, you know, as backup, right? Send him back in. And I don't have to worry, so like I assist, right? And I don't have to worry about, I can keep spamming the button. Uh, and I don't have to worry about them uh, doing something dumb, right? Though I don't like how low the pet's getting. Uh, let's see, can I target him? There you go. Let's keep him on target, just in case. Alright, we got a scout. What we're gonna do is pull him with Mez, right? Mez that mother. And nope. Not gonna happen. Alright, send the pet. <laughs> let's back off here. Uh, the armsman. Let's go with him. Mez him, maybe? Alright, that guy's mess. Alright. Assist. Nuke. <laughs> Didn't get so lucky in that uh, operation there. Let's get Rune back on. And then later on I'm going to get group runes and stuff, so that'll help alleviate some of the damage, right? But uh, it's going to take a little bit of you know practice and stuff to get used to this. Assist, let's go with a nuke, everybody nuke. And then send your pets. <laughs> there we go, and I'll nuke too. Alright, what do we got going on here? Clarity's good. Or of reverence. I mean, as long as we can charm, we should have a good time throughout most of this, right? Alright, we don't want any of this junk. 
We just won 10 nights. I can't believe it's so rare. Uh, let's see if this guy is gone yet. Already moved up. I feel like he's gonna crawl, you know what I mean? So. Hopefully that's what he does. I doubt it because I see light. <laughs> no, he's not there. He's not there. All right, all right, all right. There are no death knights here. Uh, but I know they can spawn here, so let's just see how many we get. Not that many. All right. Send down. Right, you guys follow me up here. Break follow. And we're going to make a base camp right here. So this is going to be our spot. You guys should assist me. There you go. And I guess this is where we'll pull till until we get all of the guys we need, right? Uh, junk, junk, junk. Let's roll those out. There you go. All right. A warrior. Because last time we were here, I did see. I did see. Uh, my God. Good work, you guys. I did see Death Knights that spawn statically down here, so... Uh, I think they can probably just be in any spot, but... Who knows? Hide some corpses here. You hear the pounding of hooves. That does not sound like something I want to hear, right? Alright, let's get this guy here. Go up this way. Assist me. Slow this guy. I have Mallow on the same button as my slow, so works out pretty well. And I'm using like Ice Meteor or some nonsense like that on the wizard. Uh, yeah, Ice Meteor is just like a huge ass Ice Nuke. <laughs> I don't know, I thought it was kind of cool because like Ice Comet from uh, level 49. Alright, this isn't going to be fun. Send two. Send you. Alright, you are going to get a Mez. Thank you very much. And you are going to get nuked. There we go, perfect. And let's go ahead and nuke this guy, get him out of the way. Oh, I forgot to assist. I'm gonna, it's, it's, it's a whole different way of doing it for me, so it's gonna be, uh, it's gonna take me a little while to get used to it for sure. All right, what is this guy? So that's son of a gun. Hey. Oh, that's my pet. Dumb pet. <laughs> uh, I need to install, uh, I think it was, uh, I think I was using Gina and it had a, uh, it had a um, charm break sound or I was using, cause I used to true box it, right? But I had it set somehow. I can't even remember how I did it. Uh, where the charmed pet would somehow alert me on uh, on my main computer. I think I might have been using the in-game sound filter things. I just can't remember. <laughs> uh, so if I can figure that out, it'll make things a lot easier. All right, that's good. All right, what do we got over here? We got a warrior. All right, let's clear this room here. Let's get you, bring you home. What the f What is this? <laughs> what 
did this guy come from? A tortured soul. He just showed up and started a fight. Alright, let's get uh, Bliss on this guy. There we go. Assist me. And go. Oh, no. <laughs> Another one. Look at this. Oh, gosh. Alright, let's send our pet on that one because this other one's dead. Go assist me. Of course, right? Not that lucky, huh? Luckily, these mercenaries are built like uh, brick houses. Alright, got him. Let's get on the Death Knight. Assist, kill. Uh, let's just burn this Death Knight down. This will be 3 of 5. There we go. I'm going to turn on my melee here. Alright, and then assist. What is this? A, bl a brick of blood metal. Uh, that is a vendor item, I believe. Let's get him in there, and that should work. Everybody's attacking now. If those are respawning, like the bromer here, this stuff here might be respawning. You jack lanterns are not following me. Of course. Alright, well. I'm not getting that, uh, I'm not getting a good duration out of this charm, I'll tell you that. I just want to double check up here real quick. Armsman. Assists and the pets. Yeah, there's a death knight right there. Yeah. All right, assist and let's kill this guy. There we go. All right, I guess I just. <laughs> Picked from a uh, general chat. All right. Assists and the pets. All right. We got some more damage going. So this will be four of five. Uh, no tracking. So we don't know if there's any more up. But we'll go up a little bit more and check. Since we cleared that room down there. Uh, let's get Arcane Room back on. Alright, more poison junk. Alright, we're gonna have to kill this guy. Yeah, I think moving to multi-bind uh, is uh, <laughs> it's gonna work out pretty well uh, for us. That way I can get more actions in per uh, cycle. Alright, come on, get up here, pet. There you go, good job. Good job. Let's get this one here. And... You still have, you still have charges left on that thing. I don't have that set up right on that yet. There we go. A lot of learning, and then I'll probably eventually get the uh, the Enchanter Multibind, uh, where she can uh, do more damage, but I don't think I need to with the uh, pet. All right. Let's go back down here. Oh, you're so slow there, pet. Oh, Tash wore off that guy, so let's go ahead and uh, retash him real quick. Command a drizzle. Oh. Oh. There we go, got a screenshot of that. Oh my gosh. 
There we go. That is going to be the challenge of this series, I'll tell you that. Because I don't think we can survive against some of this uh, higher level stuff. <laughs> tell you what, like, I mean, this, you know, we're over, we're over geared, right? We had, we started the game at level one with uh, Velius uh, raid gear, and uh, so we're, you know, we're, we're pretty good, or pretty far off, you know, for what we need for uh, for the game. In this early stage, but we're gonna hit a point where we're gonna get like one shot, <laughs> uh, and there's no no amount of gear that's gonna help with these characters. So this is this is gonna be a learning experience for me, and that's kind of why I said it was gonna be harder. Like uh, I know, I know it it it's it, on paper it probably isn't, but. I have I've never I've never played as a uh, caster main in a boxing situation like this. I've played an enchanter main, uh, but never a boxing main. So let's see how this goes. <laughs> All right, there's another guy over here. Let's grab him. Let's get some assist going. Send those pets. Send that pet. Come on, get some huge damage on this guy. I want as much damage as you can possibly put out. Biggest nukes. And we're going to charm our bat again. Eh, come on. There we go. Send the pet back in. So anybody out there who plays an enchanter, uh, like beyond this, like I know. I, I never charmed once on my 120 enchanter. I literally power leveled her to 120 without really even playing her. Uh, so I don't have a I don't have a clue. But uh, if let me know if this uh, mezzing still stays terrible, uh, like this where it uh, it's breaking like every every few minutes here. Oh, what is that guy? It's a scout. Never mind. Aha, there's one. All right, we're going to pull him. I think we're going to get this boar beast also. So we're going to send him in. We're going to uh, assist. Get that going. Oh, God. Really? All right. Uh, let me mez the boar beast first. That didn't even work. All right, six. Let's try and try. I don't even know who's tanking right now. Boomer Guard's tanking. All right, so... Uh, board... Wait, okay, you... Death Knight. There you go. Attack him. Assist. Attack. Four Beasts. F6. Uh, Mazd. All right, we got this under control. This would, uh... This would be quite catastrophic, honestly. There we go, and we completed the quest. We got some intricate uh, choices here we can make. Let's go ahead and uh, get this guy here. Got 14% experience for that, which uh, puts us at 89%. Uh, let's see, what do we got? Intricate cloak, intricate shoulder. We don't have an intricate belt, so we're gonna go ahead and take that, I guess. Um, that's an upgrade, I suppose. There we go. All right. <laughs> so definitely, an, it's gonna be an interesting experience, and I apologize. You know, this is more of a learning video for me, and I feel like the next next few are gonna be the same until I figure out that exact you know, flow of getting things done, right? You know, it might be not playing the Enchanter main. Like right now, I feel like this is uh, the best way to do it. And uh, just let Boomer Guard sit in the background, but I'm still not sure. I think we'll we'll get a better idea because we're going to go off to uh, Bastion of Thunder next. Are you son of a gun? 
All right. You go over there. You charm. There we go. All right. So it's a lot of a lot of learning here. All right. Let me uh, check these guys real quick so this stupid menu goes away. Uh, you have flawed belt, intricate, intricate. All right, you're gonna get the that one. Uh, what do you got? Dwarf. All right, you need the same one. All right. Put them. We'll put that stuff on later. All right, let's keep like just going through here like this, right? All right. I want a ding sixty-five before. Before we call it. What are you doing? You just gonna stand there and hope I don't kill you? What? I mean, come on. Let's get some nukes on here. But uh, next episode, we'll go to the ba uh, Bastion of uh, Thunder and uh, try our luck there and see how that goes. All right. I'll take that. All right, let's get this Oracle here. These are like 1% per with no experience bonus. I don't know if that's good or not at this point. I felt like I was getting like 3%, but when I leveled Holdridge through last, he was during uh, one of those experience bonuses. So this might just be what we can get. Uh, but 65 is a good level for us. I believe we get some new new toys, new spells. We've got a new mage pet uh, that should be able to uh, do a little bit better tanking-wise. I don't know how well this one actually is doing right now because he is uh, he's not tanking. But uh, I just feel like the, having the earth pet as the backup from this, for the charm pet is going to be the way to go for this. I don't think the pet damage is really as much as the as you know we need, right? I think we're gonna be fine. Where are we? Go, can you assist and slow and nuke? There we go. We got a lot of a lot of things going on at once. And splitting the assist in the uh, on a separate button has, uh, I think, really made things slightly uh, slightly easier. <laughs> like, I'm I'm glad I did that. Yeah, because just look at how they're uh... oh. battle wrath. All right. Assist, kill. Ninety-seven percent, not bad. Look at those big old nukes. What's he even nuking for right now? Spell damage, twenty-five hundred, seventy-six hundred crit though. Jeez. Oh my gosh. Where can we get one? <laughs> I don't want to fight like a bunch. Here's all the death knights though, back here. So if you're looking for them, this is where you find them. Uh, send the pet, assist, send the pet, slow, and nuke. There we go. I, got, I think I got the system down. There's a little optimization on the spells, like pacification and, uh, Night's Dark Terror. I'm like, I don't know if I need Night's Dark Terror. Like, I don't know if the pet really benefits from it. So, he might. And, uh, you know, we'll find out eventually, I guess. But the spell kind of drops off at some point because you don't get an upgrade for a very long time. There we go. And let's get some nukes. Slow just in case. 
There we go. This is it. And one more. All right, there we go. 65 on everybody. Perfect. Uh, let's see what we got here on the Enchanter. Uh, we got some add-ons <laughs> to, to pretty much what we already had. Critical Affliction. Uh, if we start dotting, that might be nice. I don't know if I will because the you know we we don't have really a, uh, a dotting kind of setup. Companion Fortification. This is a uh, this is a pet buff, so that's something we're probably gonna want. Mesmerite. Mesmerization Mastery. What in earth is that? I want Charm Mastery. Is what I want. Uh, let's see here. Mesmerization Mastery. Duration increases by six seconds on your single target spells. Doppelganger. Suspend Companion. Uh, Elder Troon. Fury of Magic. Nate Eminence. So, not a whole lot, like, clicky-wise that we can add to our stuff, but we got, you know, we're stronger. All right, let's take a look over here on the, uh, this is the wizard, boom regard, uh, just add-ons, uh, mental stamina, spell resistance, eh, frenzy devastation sounds awesome. What is that? Sort by name. So, increase the mana cost of 10 direct damage. Okay, so this is a burn. I'll put that in the burn macro. Ward of Destruction. This is another burn. <laughs> Silent Fire. Yeah, that's a burn. Uh, let's see here. More nukes. And we have... I've been... I think it... I don't know if it's working. Uh, but I do have Call of Zula, Zuzzle. Uh, on there, and that's a summon uh, sword that comes out and attacks. I have it. Uh, I have it in the macro. I don't, just don't know if it's working. It might have to be a uh, a little bit different. And on the mage, did you not ding? No, you did not. All right, we need four percent more. Let's let's keep going here. Then. I swore she dinged. No idea how she's four percent off. <laughs> Doesn't even make sense. They've all always been grouped. She must have been dead or something. Uh that's really what I can only thing I can think of. I really want to see what the mage gets because I really want that new uh pet spell anyway. Alright, let's burn oh my stupid pet. Yeah, that's gonna drive me insane that I I don't get a notification. There we go. That guy on there. Alright, where are we at now? A whole bunch of named mobs, what? <laughs> what is this? Is this like some kind of meeting area? Alright, we're not... Yeah. You stupid pet. These damn wizards are going to kill you, wherever they are. Like, I haven't seen them in a while. There, they show up, finally. I was going to say, I haven't seen them. An armor fragment? Alright, we'll take that. Alright, let's go back over this way, because I don't know what that plane of war stuff is. Let's hide some corpses here. Howl of Tash. Send them in. Alright, so the pet lost Tash. That is good to know. Hopefully she gets velocity at 65. So he can run a little bit faster. Alright, well. It's an add. Let's see here. Let's Tash him. Stupid, stupid, uh, pet. 
All right, you get an og. Am I not gonna be able to get this off? Right, we're gonna have, we're gonna, I'm gonna have to like add some uh, stuns on my uh, on my thing uh, on my bar. I'll have to figure that out. Cause <laughs> this is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. All right. Just a row in a row, right? All right, there she ding. All right, what'd you get? You got innate eminence. Uh, these are just add ons to what she already has. Companion shielding, so her pet will be a little bit tankier. Some uh, uh, pet buffs, right? So that's good. Oh, companion's fury, that's more damage for the pet. So nothing too fancy there. All right, so where is where's the boom? <laughs> All right, so there we go. A little bit different of a video. I'm learning, right? So I kind of I've already done this before, uh, but uh, oh, you stupid, stupid mob. Here, uh, what we'll do is uh, we'll probably go to Bastion of Thunder next and uh, keep working our way through that. Uh, with the change in the lineup, I'm not sure if all the you know the places I had on the map for where we head are uh, going to be still viable. So there is going to be some uh, some changes to that. Oh my god! And uh, we'll figure that out as we go. And I think we we might have to fall back. Like I think I was planning on going to Dragon Scale Hills, but uh, I might. I might skip that, right? I think, uh, I, I think, <laughs> I think trying to do those quests is really just a waste of, uh, waste of my time for this right now. Cause I don't know. It just takes so long to get some of those quest items. And by the time we, we do them all, we will have already out leveled the gear that we get from it. So I'm, uh, I'm going to try to find an alternate path to, uh, to that 75 plus and whatnot so we'll see how that goes but uh yeah let's just go ahead and call it here thank you very much for watching and please have a fantastic day